Biggie, oh, Biggie, 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 why are you doing this to us? Like, if you should have taken one person, at least take Rachel, leave Cheesy for us. Cheesy one name. Ah, <laughs> like I'm feeling so pained. I feel like crying. I just wish Cheesy was a, an actual housemate. Like, why Cheesy? Why Cheesy? <laughs> Please, can we cry for Cheesy? Hey, Big Brother shocked us. Although I am not so surprised. Immediately I saw that Ebuka was going into the house. I just like, ah, Ebuka just going into the house just like that. Okay, oh, let us just be watching. Even the housemate actually asked him, is anybody dipping? Basically, what the housemate mean by dipping is, is anybody leaving? And Ebuka was like, no, he, he's coming in peace just to have dinner, chit chat with the housemates and all of that. Before now, they had a task and um, I forgot the name of the task though. After the task, Big Brother told them that they had 15 minutes to actually prepare, to actually go in for a dinner. And then, after, while they were still dressing, most of them were actually dressed, um, the door of um, the house, the, the noise it makes or the sound it makes, just it made the sound. And then the housemates were like, what's happening? Like, who is coming in? And all of that. That's shock. Because that door only opens when there's an eviction. And then Big Brother now tells them to freeze the froze and while they were still there ebuka walked in ebuka went every minute ebuka went out ebuka was like why is your house so dirty big brother they say free so people are not frozen i can hear murmuring and sense they're not frozen I love that question. Like these housemates from day one they've been dirty and they were trying to okay they were still on uh, they were still frozen and they were just like hmm they were just murmuring and all of that and then it because they are big brother this is your housemates are not obeying your instruction like basically the housemates were surprised why big brother actually told them to freeze is because if they were not frozen they would have actually rushed at Ebuka and uh, I don't know what would have happened so that was just the best thing to do like the whole shock let them be frozen then uh, maybe we can't go around and all of them will like okay oh do all kind of be settled then it will car big brother and told them okay they shouldn't freeze and it because they're asking them questions okay before it because they're asking them questions none of them were they were very happy they went hugged him they were very happy basically then it can now say okay let him go around the house going around the house he now asks them why is your house dirty and all of that if you see Rachel, Rachel is just all over the place. I wonder how she's going to cope now that she has been evicted from the house. Her things, her luggages are inside the house and inside um, her room. And her luggages are also in the um, head of house lounge. So I think what's going to happen is that now that they've been evicted, Big Brother will take them to the house. Why these housemates are currently in level 3, he'll take them back to the main house so that they can actually pack their things. If not, her things were just all over the place. And I was wondering why is this girl all over the place? So, Ebuka was just disappointed in most of them, like all, all the housemates, why their house is dirty. Then Ebuka asked that question, is it because today is fine? this week is final week, you guys are um, tired they say yes oh this is the final week so they're just trying to get over everything and all of that and i'm like mm, i don't think so because when the house was even full it was even dirtier than now himself but let's just skip that then now move to level three for dinner level three dinner i was just asking myself is this a reunion before a reunion because the buzz balls that went on see i think this eviction that just happened now actually kind of um calm the tension that's that has been bred during this dinner because the questions that just kept coming up the discussions that just kept coming up like it just showed that there was there was this there was this beef that was going on between the and um, the housemate but they didn't just know how to go about it like they had silent quiet fights going in between each and every one of them each and every housemate there and it's just surprising to see that even housemate that you thought there was nothing serious going on they just had to bring out things as in things from the past and discussing all of that and i was just like this reunion before reunion like this reunion they lose i even call it reunion this dinner that's looking like a reunion is getting messy like if not the able car was there i'm sure it would have led to a serious it would have led to a serious altercation but Ebuka was able to actually calm down things 
and everybody were they just voiced out their opinions their pains and all of that and then everything was all right they continued eating the neighbor can started showing highlights of all the housemates and asked them how they felt um basically how they felt staying in the show for this long and all of them were they just gave their points individually then ebuka stood up like time to go and all of that then he now said ebukana goes ahead to say well yes he cannot just live like that he's going to do an eviction and then he said the first housemate to leave the house is rachel i was like yeah he said when he made he said rachel i knew that cheesy was going to leave because they are both riders they are both fake housemates i knew cheesy was also busy but i was just in my mind saying okay can biggie just be fair to cheesy because cheesy did an extremely good job cheesy is the best rider as far as i'm concerned in the history of big brother niger like he's the f- best fake housemate in the history of um big brother niger so rachel left and then Ebukana goes ahead to say yes, there's like going to be another eviction, and then he now says cheesy. See, Rachel, when Ebuka called her, Rachel, Rachel wanted to cry. Rachel did not expect him. She wasn't she wasn't expecting it at all. Then cheesy, cheesy now said, Oh, let him take his palm wine first before he leaves. And cheesy just left. Like the housemates are still in shock. Like they're still trying to permutate, okay, what happened, what did not happen. Even when um, Ebuka called Cheesy, Bella now said, Cheesy, are you a fake housemate? Like, I'm happy Cheesy didn't respond to that. Like the housemates are still in shock um chi chi was actually shaking she's still shaking up till now like all of them are still adding one and two to know okay how did this happen what did not happen and all of that so apparently i think one of the ninjas actually walked in and told they book her something so i think this is just like to play on the housemate basically like the um votes have been counted so the housemate is actually thinking that cheesy and rachel have the least votes that is why they've been evicted and now the housemates are just trying trying to permutate things like how can they come the same day and leave the same day like it's not it's not making sense so they're just all about arguing like okay maybe they're fake house maybe they're not fake house i just wished that big brother had told them that the housemates um that were evicted are actually fake housemates are actually right there so that at least we will see how what their reactions will be like i'm not i'm also not happy that she's left rachel left they should have at least allowed them participate in the um, saturday party okay yes they're going to participate in saturday party but they'll participate from the other end they should have just actually let them stay maybe on sunday morning they can now evict them and why the other house going to be evicted um on sunday evening that i think that's that would have been better but uh, i don't make the rules you know it's big brother that makes the rules so we are just here we're only being entertained i love the show so far i love everything that has played out in this particular season of big brother i love that the organizers actually listened to us um from what happened last year last year was a total mess i love that they actually sat down and actually thought things through and gave us a show so i'm happy about that i'm happy with everything that happened in this season the only thing i'm not happy about is the eviction of amaka the way amaka was evicted but that could be anybody so it was just amaka's uh, misfortune so let me know what you think about today's eviction of cheesy and rachel i am so pained i'll see you in my next video and bye